Act Razor, Super Nintendo, one of the early titles on the Super NES. It was a launch um, title? Yeah. Uh, I don't uh, know if it was a launch title, but it may have been. It was it, one of the first titles. It on. was what they would say in modern times was in the launch window. window yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah, sure. um, this yeah. game is from Enix, which is now part of Square Enix. It was one of my favorite games. I never owned it, mm -hmm. I, but my parents rented it yeah. over and over and over mm -hmm. again. I remember always going to KB and I saw it behind the shelf and I was like, oh, I got to get that game someday, but I never got it. So this is a game that I'm actually not very familiar with. So you I, guys are going to have to fill me yeah. in. Well, well Ryan, Ryan's going to fill us in because I, I'm a little bit familiar with it. I know uh, just, just enough about it to know what the game is, but it's been a long time. I remember that Super Nintendo had such a great launch window. They had Final Fight, F Zero, Super Mario World, Pilot Wings. Um, Pilot Wings. It, it was Pilot like they Wings. were all different. All these games were different. Mm -hmm. Ultraman. Uh, uh, was it? Was it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Include that one in there. Yeah. Right. So, so in this game, you're basically a Greek god who's come to a world that's entirely taken over by evil, and you're trying to spread your people across the world while defeating the evil. Okay, so the idea is this game has two genres to it. In one, it's like a side-scrolling action game, mm -hmm. like Castlevania. Mm -hmm. And on the other hand, it's also a city-building sim, mm -hmm. which is pretty weird. Yeah, um, I don't know of any other game that does that. And I, I think that's one of the biggest things that suffered in the second game, because we never talk about the second mm -hmm. game. I never played it. Because it's not as good, because they mm -hmm. got rid of the city-building. Oh. And it's just a side-scroller. It's just a side-scroller. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So comparable side-scrolling games, uh, you were saying before, Ghosts and Goblins? Ghosts and Goblins, Super Castlevania. Like a much easier Ghosts and Goblins, yeah, I assume. Okay. <laughs> Did you ever play Zardion? Uh, no, I didn't, but I saw the Sean Connery movie, uh, I think it's Zardon. Or, Zar oh, wait, am I thinking of Power Rangers? Oh, or Zordon. <laughs> Zordon, yeah. No, so, so that's another game. It's like a mech side-scroller where there's three different types of mechs you can play. Hmm. Okay. For Super Nintendo. So it's, it's just like that game. You... So what's this part? This is the building part, right? Yeah, so this is Fillmore. This is the first level. And the city... Basically, the game follows this pattern. You unlock an area by fighting a side-scrolling level. Then your little Cupid dude comes down, and you have to build a city and fight monster lairs. Okay. And the whole game has like a Greek mythology theme to it like sort of like a kid Icarus type of thing right Exa exactly and in, in addition to just shooting and building you also have godlike godly powers that you can use like i could send lightning down and then these guys are going to be able to build here once i send the lightning down okay so who's built the people in the town are building the stuff you basically just set a direction that they're going to build in you're the god and you're telling them what to do they got yeah, right. and then the little the little dude protects them from evil. Ba basically, the from the, the the little Cupid guy protects them from the monster lairs. Okay. But now, now since I've killed all the monster lairs, we don't have to keep building. I can go. We can go fight the side scrolling stage. What is the Cupid guy's relation to the side scrolling guys? He's like his helper. He's his helper. He's yeah. like the snarf. Of yeah. Every town they discover stuff while they're closing the monster lairs or they learn stuff like they learn to go fishing they learn to build bridges so in the next world in blood pool we're going to need bridges so i'm taking the bridge building technique you guys ready for mode seven yeah <laughs> so is is there actually i mean i know i made a joke in a video but is there actually any modes between like you know is there a mode yeah. three? A there, mode there three? are. There's not seven. I, I don't think. And correct me if I'm wrong. Most games, there was only like two or three modes mm. that they actually used. Uh huh. But like the one we always talk about is mode seven, like F Zero, Mario Kart, mm -hmm. this, uh, the the map screen in Final Fantasy VI. You ready? Yeah. This is cool. oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yes. Oh! <laughs> it's great. And then it's this game. It's like a completely different game now. Yeah. This is like what I know and what I see in like all Nintendo Power and magazines, the magazines and stuff. They yeah. would always show this. Yeah. Not so much the 
Well, I remember when they were showing off the graphic capabilities of the Super Nintendo, they'd always use images uh, from this game mm -hmm. and, and a lot of the other ones. Uh, Super Ghouls and Ghosts was, was one. That game is beautiful. Yeah. That might be the most good looking Super Nintendo game. That and maybe Mario World. Like the early. Like ones, from the early ones, yeah. I, I, mean, I mean, there's yeah. a lot of I mean, uh, amazing ones. No, there are, but I don't. Mm. I just really love the way go, uh, Ghouls oh, and Ghosts. Oh yeah, like. Castlevania Four. Well, yeah, there you go. There's another great one. I mean, you're right. There's plenty, but yeah, we could list them all, and it would take us hours. <laughs> yeah, let, should I just read all the Super Nintendo? Just read. I got all the games up there. <laughs> yeah. Is this supposed to be like ancient Greece or what? I would think. Yeah, so. I'm gonna go with that. You're. It, it's like the the gods and heroes, you know. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm sure it's like a fake fantasy thing. It's not yeah. actually supposed to be, but it's that type of style. Yeah, and this game is another game from the Patience Collection. Where you have to be patient. To... The patience collection. <laughs> get, get... The, the new bundle. Um, we were, we were of... talking about that, like, like how how Super Nintendo games taught a generation patience. Yeah. yeah. You have to wait. Yeah, you, you have to wait basically. I'm just going for it. You got him. Cool. Yeah. So what are all these different icons? Yeah, what, it's population, what, the angel's health. It's we're in simulation mode, and we're, you know, the angel has that much health. Here. What's the SP for? That, I think that's how much they need before they can build another, uh... Like, did you see how me using sunlight took away power from that? Sure. Um, instead of building that way, I'm going to direct them to build... To here. Oh, I have to give them the, the thing, don't I? Okay, so all the people are going out and they're building in that area. Yeah. So I get more SP by killing the enemies. Oh yeah, I forget when you hit him, he he spins. Yeah, I can't shoot till I get health back. I'm basically dead. Hey, you health back. Uh, it'll come back after a while. Okay. See what the... You're doing a lot of killing these things. Like what? Because I have to. Or yeah. it'll a destroy the town. B. That's how I get the points to do the sunlight that I need to. So what you're doing, you, you're supposed to be doing this. Yes. Okay. Ye of little faith. Well, I don't know because I'm not, you know, familiar. You're, you're not a, an expert not, at not, act razor. I'm not. What do they call an act razor expert? An axe hole. An <laughs> an an activist. And That's funny. Act sparked. You gonna do like the metal version of this song? Oh, I wonder how. Yeah. Could be. Yeah. Exactly. So, Sir James, if we destroy the monsters in this area, Sir James, are you ready? Yeah, so we're going into the castle here to fight the the final boss of Bloodpool. The final boss of Bloodpool. What other games do that? That spinning going into Oh, that, the... that is cool. I do like that. Uh, Piloing sort of does it when you're like doing the parachuting and <laughs> it's rotating. Yeah. Final Fantasy VI, I think, does that. Yeah. Okay, it's three on Super Nintendo, but. Uh, um, There's that's something the else I'm magic. thinking about that does it. Uh, yeah. Ghost of Goblins does something like that where yeah. it goes into the, it doesn't do it overhead it does it like into the castle yeah. Like that. yeah this stage is awesome look at this you yeah. got the moon you got this the... is like a Castlevania right here mm -hmm. oh oh this is Mike's favorite part of the game right oh, here it's dark yeah is that why yeah oh I see what's happening we yeah. we know we, I know you love these parts of the game Top ten stages that get dark. I guess you are. Yeah. And the video would just all be black. Like, like... <laughs> it's just black and they're not even... Yeah, that'd be real successful. Video. So, like, if I want to go down there... I should just give up. <laughs> Alright, here we go. You're trying to get to the left? Yeah. I see the spikes are there. Like, it has to be lined up right. Like, just perfect. You know? Yeah. Next one. Oh, uh, not quite. Nope. All right, should we just... <laughs> just You were trying to save it. Or is that a save point, or is that energy? That's energy. No, that's health and yeah. stuff. 
It would have been good to get it. Now you kind of need it, right? But you're going to have to fight a whole boss on four health bars? No. There, there's always health <laughs> before the boss in uh, some okay. way, shape, or form. Well, then don't get hit anymore. Sure. <laughs> okay, just, good. just don't get hit. Thanks. Just what, what do you recommend, Mike? Tell me. I recommend not getting hit. That might work, I think. Is that is that a good plan, mm -hmm. you think? Mm -hmm. And this fucking guy, you can't uh, plan. See, now you're down to three health bars, so I definitely would recommend not getting hit more than that. Maybe sure. maybe you could get hit two more times, but don't. Get but hit more three. Than that oh, now. I'm at full health. There you so go. can I get can I get hit? Now, now you can get hit more. Okay, thank you. But I would suggest not getting hit. You, you if can, possible. but you can get hit more. You can. I may get hit, but <clears throat> I shouldn't get hit. Yeah. I'll look at that background. This is cool. It's great. Right now, this is a bad situation because he has more life than you do. So you want to change that situation so that sure. he dies first before you die. Yo, nice, nice. That's why you get my expert opinion. Well, now he oh, turns into... Oh, God. Oh. Werewolf from London? No, uh, American Werewolf from London. It's the American Werewolf in London, please. <laughs> oh, I didn't have the on there. You didn't have no, the... It's, it's an American Werewolf in London. There you go, it is uh, an. Yeah. Oh, no, it's... An interview with the vampire. That's oh, what he's that, thinking of that. that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that whole thing. It, this is ridiculous. This level. Like, how are you supposed to get by that without getting hit? And I haven't seen any spells or anything yet. Have you been doing anything besides? I don't know the sword? what the game has or anything. Yeah, I did the Stardust thing, but the that enemy that I was like, how are you supposed to jump over this shit? The jump is awful. Like, the, look how high this jump is. That's all you can do, and you're supposed it's to make not it bad. over. It. The, the thing that always helped me was remembering how many hits each of the enemies took. So, like, they oh, take yeah, two. Yeah. And, then, and then you kind of know how much you have to expose yourself to. And the sword is really delayed. Yeah. The other thing I want to mention is at the end of the game, you have to kill all the bosses again. <laughs> one after another. Wow. It's one of those. It's yeah. Man. It is one of those. I think you'll get used to it and you'll be like, oh. Yeah, I'm, no I'm just not used to it at all. Yeah. At least it doesn't knock you back. A little bit, but not yeah, when you're not in the like air. Yeah, not like crazy, though, yeah. It's yeah. not like Castlevania. Yeah, I think there's health up there or something. Yeah. <laughs> I oh. just took a big leap, <laughs> leap of, faith. of faith. I'm like, I don't know. Yeah, you're like, fuck it. Fuck it, I don't care. Yeah. You only live once. <laughs> live for your die hard. <laughs> when, next time he pops up. Is it A for magic? Yeah. Is that magic? See how much damage oh, that okay. did to him? Do I have more? Yeah, you do, wait till he pops up again. Okay. How long is he gonna do that for? Oh, well, if he's gonna keep doing it, then you, you use the magic on him. Fuck him. Oh, I almost had it too. Yeah. God. Fucker. Yeah, you just, you just hit him once, he's done. There you go. Alright. It was the sandworm from Jedi. Yeah. The Sarlacc. Oh yeah, that's our life. That's right. Yeah. Sorry, I'm thinking I got a uh, Beetlejuice on the mind. My master, some of our people ventured out. Please lead us to them. So we got to go save this asshole. So I see what people say when it's like that it's like SimCity, but it's it's not like SimCity. It's City. very basic. Yeah. It's SimCity, but with you know a naked uh, Cupid going around shooting arrows that doubles <laughs> that spin north when you hit him. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Same thing. Oh, I like you have like the Nazca lines up there. Yeah, up here. Those. NASCAR. Oh, like uh, uh, you know the Nazca lines, or <laughs> like the the mysterious lines that the shapes that are like in the ground. Like, yeah. That you can only see from the air. You, you know what I think's funny? They have all their their like cultures confused because there's the Nazca lines and then there's the Egyptian. Oh, it's, everything's it's all together. Pyramid. It's like some like bundle of. And you're like a Greek guy. Like, right, it's like yeah. all over the place. They're just like, oh, we're just going to pull whatever we want. Mummies and Greek shit. And it's just throw like it all whatever. In there. Like th yeah. throw a Scotty dog in there. Osiris just stabbed you. Mm -hmm. When would you ever uh, be in a situation in real life where you have to do this? Motherfucker. Oh, oh that was actually kind of nice. I don't know. Oh, there he is. There he is. Yeah. Oh. Trump Mathis. It, it feels like the, the the delay on the sword feels like you're swinging a heavy sword. Yeah. Maybe they're trying to make it realistic. I did feel like there was a delay on that sword. Yeah. I think it's great. I think this game is great. And I have no complaints. I'm not, no, I'm not complaining about it. <laughs> I'm kidding. I, I have no complaints. Yeah. 
I was trying to get used to the game at first because every game yeah. has a little bit of a learning yeah, curve, you know. Absolutely. And I had I'm not very familiar with the game. When when are you ever in a pyramid where they're dropping? When 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 does any of this? This ever is happen? like an average trip to Egypt. <laughs> this is what happens. This is what happens. Last time I was at the pyramids, it was totally like this. If you were there thousands of years ago, this would have been happening. Yeah. There'd be like there'd be Greek yeah. gods like walking around <laughs> in Egypt. Yeah. Game makes no sense. It, see those arrow shooters with the gold helmets? Yeah. There's no way I'd slash them to pieces. I'd be like collecting them. Yeah, right. So Try I could sell, sell them. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good point. Oh, this jump's fun. I remember this. This looks terrible. I remember you this. You gotta wait for this, this jump. When is it coming? There it is. Yeah. Go. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. Oh, I oh, went that oh, one. Go. What yes. the fuck? He. <laughs> oh. So you gotta land on and then jump. Here we go. Second right. try. Remember to jump when yeah. you get to the spikes. Yeah. Oh. Jump! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! 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 Sword, sword, got, I got him, I got him. Sword, sword him up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, yeah! yeah! Fuck you, King Tut. <laughs> Look, they invented music. Wow. Well, we've been hearing music the whole game, so I don't know how music was just invented. Well, <laughs> no, I mean, I, I'm like, making a joke. I know. Yeah. So, so, but, so. In the original town, the people were angry, yeah. and music soothes the soul. So if we go back to the original town and teach them music, they'll be able to continue growing. What if it's the ninja rap? Go ninja, go, go ninja, ninja go. go. Is that soul soothing? Sure. I mean, it, it, for some people. Yeah. For Ninja Turtles. I'm just gonna give them a music icon, and whatever they do with the music icon is their own business. So in between side-scrolling areas is how you're increasing your health and magic. Yeah, you want to check in on all your your people. Because, like, I was able to do the fishing and do this and look. Oh, you're going to yeah. each area and seeing what's going, like, checking in on everybody before you go to the next area? Yeah. Like, for instance, we built these two towns up enough that they're connected now. Okay. And stuff like so that. So do we want to revisit any of the areas right now that we have already built before going to the next area or do we not need to do that? Can we we, we don't, next... we're, we're in good shape We're in now. good shape, okay. So where are we going So, now? not this. So, Itos and Northwall are like the last two. Okay. So we're kind of in the middle of the game right now. Okay. So we're gonna go to Marana. And actually this is one of the harder side-scrolling levels. Oh, it's Stonehenge. Stonehenge. Yeah. Well, they're all Stonehenge, yeah. Oh, okay. And then the Stonehenge turns into the temple. Marina, Sirtis. Oh. So here's your classic, like, Aztec stage. <laughs> Alright, where's this guy? There we go, look at this. Is this the boss already? Yeah. That was really I hard. went. I went, like, straight to him. Yeah, okay. You got magic? I do. It doesn't seem to be working too great. <laughs> Only if it, you see, it has to actually it, hit. Yeah, <laughs> like, like there'd be, there's better. You need a different magic. Yeah. Is there a different types of magic? Or is that the like the only attack that there is with magic? Oh, that's mm -hmm. not. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll beat him. This is what Super Nintendo is all about. A giant boss on the screen that's like bigger than you know than the life itself. Screen. And then hitting it a bunch of times so it keeps blinking and eventually explodes. That's true. <laughs> that's what a lot of. That's basically all of Super Nintendo. Yeah. That's what Super Nintendo is all about. Yeah. If I had the regular fire magic, I would have rocked that guy. Mm. Can you switch to it? You can't switch in the level. That's the problem. Uh, I think they should fix that. <laughs> yeah. They no, should... Let's go back. Yeah. Ask them to fix that yeah, in the next. Come on. Like when. When they release it on Virtual Console for fucking Switch, they should fix it. How about that? Ha ha. Mm. Yeah. Because they're still back then. There wasn't even like versions of games. It was just kind of. Nah, like, like, well, you know, what, you, it was. It came in a box. It came in a cardboard box. It came box. in a box. They weren't gonna fucking fix it because it's like <laughs> it was what it was. Yeah. 
They weren't gonna come to your house. Miyamoto comes with like a toolbox and yeah. a screwdriver, and he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna fix that." That would be amazing. Could you like like like? You got to give him credit if he's going to do that. He's going to go uh, to everybody's house. He's like Santa Claus. Yeah. Yeah. He's able to go to everybody's house. Every little boy and girl's house. Yeah. Gives, gets them the new games. Mm -hmm. oh. It'd be good if that magically like, even hit killed the thing you on know, the bottom. If only it was going the other way. Like if there was a way to direct it to the right instead right. of the left. Yeah. To change the direction It'd be of the good. wind. Use the wind waker. You know what I was thinking with this guy? Yeah. Hey, dude, what's up? Oh, that's Peace. a good idea, and then yeah, go and get yeah. a couple hits and go back. Yeah. yeah. Although then there's that blue thing that comes out. You should do it again. Yeah, oh. yeah that thing's kind of a, a bitch. It is. But you gotta watch that, too. Yeah, that thing sucks. I mean, it's a good idea if you would've probably done it from the beginning. Ooh. Oh. And then these things suck. Oh, man. Oh. oh boy. Yeah, not good. Nah. Mm -hmm. You need that other fucking. Well, now that I died, I can switch the magic. Okay. And then I could be cheap. Well, they're being cheap, so be yeah. cheap back. I hate the delay between when you hit a menu item, the mm -hmm. text has to come, and then that, that menu is immediately yeah. active. Oh my god! Oh! Oh, 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 oh come on! Oh, yeah, that was so irritating. Oh, oh man! Come on! Kill uh, Phoebe Seymour. <laughs> What's the plant's name? In uh, Audrey? Yeah. yeah. It's Audrey. One Look, more, one more! Little Audrey. Kill it! Yeah! yeah. There you go. Audrey's oh, wait, dead. it's still go- <laughs> Alright. No, could you imagine second form? <laughs> it's yeah. like just a random yeah. act one fight. Yeah. See? That was the boss of that whole area? That's the boss to open up the area. Oh. That's not the final boss of the area. I was area. gonna say that was pretty, pretty simple, I yeah. thought. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we have three worlds left. Mm -hmm. There is a, and, and the last world we're working up to is a. Is it, it's ice, North ice Wall. World. It's like the Ice and Snow World. I love Super Nintendo. It just I don't know what what it is, but I just feel at home when it comes to Super Nintendo. I mean, I think Super Nintendo is probably the best console. Most people. A Depends people, what kind of games you like. That, yeah. Yeah, if you're in the know, you know that. If you're in the, the know. <laughs> uh. a, son of, a, a temple appeared, and the people are saying they built it to worship you, but there's something wrong, mm -hmm. and the monsters aren't going near it. Is this game for your ego? Oh, what? Because you have, like, a god <laughs> complex? You're like, yes, I am god of the natives! Oh. Yeah. Because <laughs> I've heard people say that this is a very difficult game. I, I don't think it's a very difficult game. It seems, like, moderately difficult to me, I guess. I, 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 I mean, the uh, the 2D, like, the side-scrolling parts are definitely more difficult than this part. Right. But, I mean, I, mean, I beat this game when I was very young, you know? Right. Mm -hmm. Is is that the barometer, right? If like a, if we were as familiar with it as you, I, I think it's like a fair difficulty. It's it's you know it's nothing too crazy. Right. It's not annoying. No. Yeah, that is one thing about at least game. not there's, yet. There, there's nothing wrong with the game. Like I haven't found any complaints really. It's like a very well designed game. Mm -hmm. It's a great showpiece for the Super Nintendo for the new Super Nintendo at that time mm -hmm. because it uses a lot of like the scaling effects. It uses the Mode 7. It uses sprite scaling. It uses all the features that differentiated the uh, NES from the Super Nintendo. The, yeah, the NES from the Super Nintendo. Exactly. I find it very peaceful to watch. <laughs> like SimCity. <laughs> you know what I think it is? I think I just like have some kind of obsession with geography oh yeah like all these games that have this sort of like you know aerial view mm -hmm. where you have like a, a land to observe 
Yeah, when I originally played this game, I played it over the same winner that I played, like, SimCity 2000 and that. So, I think I might have the compass. I may be able to give it to these guys. Was that SNES? Or is that PC? SimCity 2000. I think there's an SNES version. I think there is. Yeah. But, uh... You weren't doing it on that. I played, I played regular SimCity on Super Nintendo. Right. Um... And SimCity 2000 but, PC. But I'll never forget, my uh, my mom wanted to play SimCity 2000, and there was a snowstorm, and she made me and my dad go out in, like, not, like, an inch of snow, like, six inches of snow, to get the the graphics card we needed to play the to game. Play the game. <laughs> and it was, like, a ridiculous amount of snow. Like, it was up to the bumper, like, we were pushing through. Just to go out to get the card. Yeah. Yeah, for the computer. Okay. I so. wonder what this game would look like from the ground. If you were in one of those houses, and then every once in a while you see this naked baby flying overhead. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> like a giant yeah. naked baby, too. It's not just like a naked baby. Yeah. But it well, could be or, perspective. Wait, it's, okay. Yeah, I think right. it's perspective. I think. Because, I mean, he looks like the same size as those buildings. Yeah, I think it's but just because that's where the... flying over them. Yeah, it's where the camera is. It's just like... <laughs> the camera? The, the camera <laughs> angle. Yeah. Like, who's... Because yeah. he's camera. high. Because think about how, how high off the ground he is. Like, he's... He's got to be, like... I mean, I don't know, like a, a few hundred feet, or maybe yeah. even more than that. How high is the Cupid? I think it's got to be like a couple thousand feet. I think the compass is in blood pool. Blood pool. Yeah, you see how now when you saw that Sky Palace, you were even farther off the ground, like yeah. everything got even smaller. So. Yeah, when you're looking down at the baby right here, the camera is in the Sky Palace. Oh, the camera is at the bottom of the palace. Like yeah, looking at there's the a baby. camera. Yeah. There's like a security camera yeah. on the bottom of the... Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> a security just, camera. God is like... It's a security it's camera. Just, uh, it's like this. Yeah. I know what I have to do. Oh, good. This is the only part of the game where you have to do this. You're queen. That's an oh, earthquake. Ah, wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh, you just fucking leveled that whole you area. You did. You just annihilated. <laughs> oh my god, the whole like world. Fuck them. <laughs> Wait, was that good? Yeah, it was because now. Well, why you you killed or you at least destroyed their homes? They're just like subjects, okay? Don't oh. <laughs> don't worry about them. Oh my they're... god, look at all them. Look at how many lives you just. <laughs> James, they're not gods. Look, only we're... gods deserve to live. <laughs> look, look, we, we we were fine. We were like one to two thousand feet away. I mean, you... like we're the naked baby. Wait, are there we're, any we're, homes? We're still fine, so don't worry about those people. Is anybody alive? No, they're all dead. They're, we killed them all. <laughs> there's but... no, there's no homes. <laughs> no, look, just... so that guy. That guy's alive. Look, he's he made the it. only guy. Look. Oh, they're, they're okay. They're rebuilding their homes. See. See, this is like that episode. Yeah, no, what really happened with the earthquake? This, this is, We connected the two pieces of land so we could go close the layer. Oh, the fucking the continents like came together? Yeah, what, wow. you know, sometimes to make an omelet, you gotta break a few eggs. Okay. We leveled the town. That's the type of. But now of we're gonna have a, a an omelet. A tasty villager omelet. <clears throat> you ready? All right. You pumped? All right, I'm pumped. So what do we got? Yeah! Is this yeah. a mountain? Oh, God. Oh, it's, we're going down! <laughs> it's Contra 3, the Alien Wars. It's... Yeah. Is that him, like, screaming? Like, <gasps> Look at all the... F yeah. This was a cool idea back then, to, to go behind things. The foreground. And then you could see the background has its own plane. Like, that was a big deal. That's true, it was. You're gonna have to jump right away. Nice. He's good. All right. You got the uh, magic pack, too. You can jump faith. down. Yeah. Ah! Oh, the, oh that would have sucked. <laughs> I love how there's spikes on both sides. It's like, yeah. come on. Oh, Ryan, you should be doing this. There's spikes. Yeah, I'm glad I, I finally dodged the bullet or the spike. Ah! Whoa, that was lucky. I, you know, as, as a kid, I didn't even question the enemies in this game. There's lizards with one frame of animation. There's flying snakes. There's red balls, and yeah, there's pink Grim Reapers. It's very random. Oh, oh that is health, uh, you and want you need that. it. You want you that. Gotta, yeah, don't. Ah! Hit it. Oh! oh. Wait, 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 what happened? Oh, that's the death pose. Yeah, he... yeah, I forgot. This is the part that sucks, because... Ugh. So, we we talked about the reason why, why Karen, 
current gamers aren't as patient as we are because every uh like super nintendo nintendo game is like a patience check yeah it's there's like, more checkpoints if you jump on top games, of that and duck you can like, well yeah. the only thing and okay, you sure if I duck? Yeah, you try. Right. I mean, why I'll not try? try. Why well, not I, attempt it? You I, got a million well, here's lives. Here's the thing: if I jump from here, it's gonna like go past that. But I'll jump. see. Duck. All right, no, it, it worked. See? There you go. All right, cool. All right. Oh, you can get hit by that guy. Oh, uh, get past the pink reaper. Jump. There you go. Just hit him once and I'm, get off. I'm gonna just try the slowest strategy I can just to like stay alive. I mean, that, that's what I usually do. You, you need to be standing wanna... a little bit more to the right. Fine, like, you really wanna, yeah. Okay, yeah. I, I'm just trying to get that Hit him thing. once, get off! I'm fine. No, he'll hit you though. He'll hit me up here? Yeah, when, when it, it drops, I think he'll be able to hit you. Yeah. If it drops. Like okay. that. Okay, that's gotcha, all right. That's yeah. why well, it's, then... it's once and off. Well then how do I? So I gotta jump. Well, if I jump off that quick, I might hit the spikes on the top. You don't jump off. You walk off. Yeah. Walk, okay. So walk I to the left. walk yeah. off before the thing goes up. So here you're going left. There you go. Good. All right. Got that down. Remember right. to back up. Oh, I didn't get the guys. one up, but whatever. Remember to back up. Yeah. These dudes. All right. You're getting a little. <laughs> I too know. Close I'm like getting. Yeah. I'm getting murdered yeah. on this. Thing. Try to stay more to the left side of that platform if you, if it's possible. See, now it's like the platform doesn't want to come down again. Because he's yeah. doing the electric. He can only do one oh, or the other. When he see, do... see how he moves his hand when the ah, thing goes down? Okay. Yeah. yeah. So For basically... me, it's hard to watch him because I have to watch where I am. Right. Because if I don't, those things are going to come down and kill me. That's what's happening. Basically, when the boss is doing some bullshit, it okay. doesn't let it, like, you know. Yeah, it's like one or the other. All right, I got to concentrate. Which is actually kind of forgiving because if... It's not like you could do the spike and then you have to also dodge. Yeah, that. if that was all happening at the same time, then it would be like really He's gone. If, if he doesn't, yeah. yeah. Just one more hit. He's got it. Boom, dead. Yeah. There you go. Fuck yeah! yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, that's what it's all about. Getting fucking frustrated, and <laughs> that's that's the Nintendo days for you. It's not. It's not an accomplishment, really. If you if <laughs> you don't get frustrated. No. <laughs> You've said that you've played Act Razor 2. Like, what's that game like? Is it totally different than it's, this? No, it's just the side-scrolling levels, and he has uh, wings, so he can, like, hover. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't sound bad to me. You don't like it, though? What's bad about it's, it? It's much harder. That's harder. <laughs> but maybe it's only harder because... Uh, you were younger? You yeah, yeah, maybe. Maybe we should play it. Do you have Act Razor 2, sure? I am, uh, I don't think so, no. Yeah. <clears throat> was there only two? Was there any more than that? As far as I know, there was two. Is there? You know, There's only two. Okay. Hmm. That's a franchise that could come back. It should. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And on this map now, there's like... <laughs> oh, my God. It's like <laughs> yeah. hell, Hellfire. Yeah. This is how your game what would always... What did you do? Yeah. This is how your game would always be. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, this is the Mike Matei version of Act Razor. <laughs> yeah, I'd be more than like frowny face purple if there's fire raining down on me. And all the people would just be getting whipped by demons, like in a corner. Succubuses. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Look at these assholes. With their endless amounts of flaming arrows. I'm not fucking around now. Yeah, I can tell you're like... <laughs> How'd those guys get the job down here? <laughs> In hell, yeah. firing arrows all day. At what, whatever might come. It's a war, alright? Oh, nice. That might not be helpful. No, that's that. More power, magic. Nice. And you have more. Nice. Are you even gonna have to hit him yourself? No. Yeah. Wow. Oh. Boom. All yeah. right. <laughs> well, that's how you take care of that boss. Yeah, that's that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm like really. I better run back. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. 
I think it's just like a normal jump. Really? Yeah, they're just fucking with you. Oh. Yeah. That, that did not look like I could yeah. make it. It didn't. Oh, th so those ones stay. That's a little more fair. Look how that gargoyle is just in an eternal pose. He's just like posing like he's cool while he's blasting you with projectiles. That they look, good. They, they, they look like the weeping angels from uh, Doctor Who. Hmm. I'm not familiar with those. I'm so surprised. Okay. Yeah. I want to say something. Mm -hmm. I'm so surprised that that you guys have watched like all of this like different yeah. different you know sci-fi uh -huh. fantasy shit. It wasn't, yeah. no, it, it wasn't available in the United States. No Doctor Who. It, it, it became available in like 2005 or something, like because the, they, yeah. they made a new series that was like uh, revamped. But would you recommend starting with the new Just series? Just watch the new one. Because here's the thing, when did, when did you watch it? Ryan, when did you uh, watch There it? was a kid when I was in college who had them all. And what year was that? Uh, it was 2000. And, and that's, five was the end, and of that's it. why we didn't watch it because it yeah, wasn't five, four, three, and two. Yeah. All the shit that we, you know what? Like, all the shit that we're nostalgic it. for and we watch is like in the nineties and the like yeah, eighties and nineties. Yeah. For me, it's weird. It's like the sixties and, and the eighties for some right. reason. It's like, but anyway, like it wasn't around actually, when we were watching TV. Yeah, I actually did watch a, a bunch of the first season. Of, well, it's really the, good to be on that. Yeah, the first season of the the two thousand five or whatever. Get there. Yeah. And my conclusion, it's basically like Bill and uh, Ted ripped it off. Because it's like the right. same thing. It's like there's a guy who travels around in, inside of a phone booth. I mean, it's a police box, but it's the same thing, basically. And yeah. goes through different times and stuff. Well, to me, Doctor Who is Star Trek without the ship. Mm-hmm. I mean, that... With, like, time travel all the time and everything. Yeah. But, like, like it's Star, Star Trek has mm -hmm. time travel. And I don't mean, like, traveling through time. I mean, like... We're gonna go yeah. to the Roman world, uh -huh. or the, yeah, you know. Like, there's some of that, but it's like. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta jump when it jump. There we go. Yeah, that's the, the ticket. That's the ticket. Mm-hmm. All right, just blow him up with the spell. Is he hitting me when I do the magic? Oh, yeah, you no, got a lot when of you that do magic. the magic, oh. you're you're invincible. Nice. Oh, you got. Wow. Yeah, that when he swoops in from the left. Give He's him got no legs. He's got no legs. James go. is like, he's got no legs. I, think I just, just want to point you know, <laughs> No legs! Well, why? It's like an odd choice, you know? Yeah. yeah. I just like, what's the yeah. reason? You know? He's got no legs. Yeah. <laughs> See? That? All right. Now I gotta kill all the bosses. Oh, God, yeah. Look at... This is awesome. Yeah. Look at this. Again, a fine example of what my video game would look like. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, so he's in the red speedo again. <laughs> oh, I forgot about this guy. T top two characters in, in red speedos uh, that are devils. The other, can you think of the other one? There's another one. Um, Castlevania yeah. Dracula X. Okay, I, I believe that's why it's a top two. <laughs> yeah, I mean it could be more than a top two. If, if I could think of one. one, if you could fucking think of one, you lazy <laughs> bastard, there would be more than two. <laughs> All right, so this is the last boss, huh? No. no. Oh, it's this not. This is okay. the first boss of the game. Oh, you gotta fight him over. Now it's I get one of it. those. It's Mega Man. Yeah. Well, it's one of those. Yeah. Yeah. But I think they give you all your life back, or some of your life back, or nothing. <laughs> or none of your life back. Great. Oh, I remember this. It like picks a battle. Yeah. It gives you nothing back. Yeah. So I should pretty. But much... eventually, it gives you something back. I think. I, me I remember seeing you do this before, actually. Yeah. No, you're gonna need to know exactly what to do and make it through all of it. Yeah. <clears throat> if you if you beat the rest of this on one life bar, then... yeah, I will. Yeah. So you I know, think I get to continue where I was. Yeah. Okay. That's nice. But there's lives. Okay, now she does this. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that part I remember. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Oh. I can't believe you have to fight every single one of them. Yeah. This boss is dumb. Hmm. Is there one like this in Life Force? Yeah, I believe there is. This guy you wrecked with the magic, actually. Yeah, this is...
you gotta be in the air for that. Hmm. You know the death pose um, tricks me out every time because every time I see him kneel like that, the sword, I think he's doing like a special move. Right, like magic would happen or something. Like you gotta yeah. be. I, I remember what I have to do, do but it's like. James, do you want to do this part? <laughs> <laughs> and it, you know what's crazy? At least about I know this? How, yeah. It's like straight up. They don't make it any easier. It's like straight up, just fighting. Yeah. yeah. The same. Because a lot of times with games, like when you have to fight all the bosses over, they make them slightly easier. Mm -hmm. But they're not doing that. Here, so you or you'll have like stronger powers when you get up to him the second time. Yeah. This right. time it's yeah. like you got the same. Same shit. I wish you had that that projectile sword still with that like sonic boom. Yeah. What happened? Yeah. Oh, yeah. are you gonna have to fight that dragon thing again? That green dragon. No, that's a a, a starting boss. Now okay. Not. Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah. Isn't it hard to dodge that? Um... Yeah. Holy crap, what happened? Where are we? Whoa, we're wearing different clothes all of a sudden. All right, so what happened, guys, is we ran out of time, but mm -hmm. we're gonna finish the game. Mm -hmm. Now, we're in a different place. Yep. So. It's a month later. Here we yes. go. Do, 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 do. It's up to this guy here. Oh, yeah, it's, it's like a month later. <laughs> yeah, did, didn't we like almost beat that? Yeah, we got to here, but we ran out of time, so. Yeah. So like I have like all the other magic now and so so you should be stuff, good. Yeah. Oh yeah, check it out. We got uh, a lot more stuff since last time. Yeah, you're back to like yeah, figuring out how the game anymore. Yeah, I know, right? This is like not a good time to be in this. Like the hardest part of the game. Yeah, right. You never really figured out anything with this guy, right? No, like, this this is the guy with, that I have no. Uh... There's got to be a better way, something to do with him. Yeah, there, there's got to be a better way. That that was not the, the way, though. That couldn't that, be the ideal way. That's not the You know there's some asshole out there who, who's done that without getting hit. Yeah, right? That asshole. This guy turns into the werewolf, right? Yeah. Isn't this a woman that turns into the werewolf? We'll go with or that. that a werewoman? A were, werewolf. <laughs> a werewoman. Has that, hey, James, has that ever been like a thing? Uh, usually they just say she-wolf. She, oh, duh. You're right. I forgot about she -Wolf. Curse of the Werewoman. That's a movie that could exist. Curse of the Werewoman. You just killed the she wear uh, The she wear And now it's a she wear Wait, wait, wait. What did we call it before? The she wolf she wolf. she wolf Yeah. yeah. Went from Werewoman to she wear The wolf part keeps getting yeah. taken out. I have so much more magic and health. Oh, are you, like, not too concerned because you have so much more? Yeah, it's like... Like, like I and I have more base lives too. I think I have four base lives. Right. Like if you don't get it this time, you probably get it next time. Yeah. Like, it's gonna be much better. Like this guy, you like, he was fucking up your yeah, day. Yeah. Like, like, yeah. You know, yeah. <laughs> it's it's way different. Yeah. It helps to actually like get all the items that you need in the game. Yeah. It's kind of at this point. I I would have to say that my one like pro tip for this title is. Get the things, you know? Oh, this sh shit. Yeah, like... You can do this, though. Yeah. This is James' favorite boss. Remember this guy, James? Oh, this guy? Yeah, remember you fought this oh, guy. Oh, no. That's right. This is horrible. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Damn. There we go. Oh, here we go. There. This is the final All boss. Right. Oh, okay. my God. Look, look, at, look, at, boom, look, look, at, look at his life. Look at his life going down. Sonic boom, Sonic boom, Sonic boom, Sonic boom, Sonic boom, Sonic boom. I didn't expect you to like fuck this guy up so good. There we go. No, it, oh, come on. Oh, there's more forms. Okay. Oh, yeah. there we go. No, oh okay. my god, look at all that health. Oh my god. Oh shit. That is an awesome boss, by the way. That look at this. Cool. Look at the background. Yeah, he's really cool. This is awesome. Oh, wow. so you're hitting that like little yeah. cotton ball. What would you do without that thing? Yeah, exactly. You probably wouldn't even make it here if you didn't have that. Don't die. That's my that's my yeah. tip for you, Ryan. Thanks for the thanks for the pro tip. You're, well, you're just, welcome. Uh, just don't let anything hit you. <laughs> you're, Ryan's really glad we're here right now. <laughs> you guys are so fucking helpful. 
Oh my god. Hit him with your sword. There you go. Nice. Fuck All that right. guy. Is there any more forms? Here comes the tenth form of this guy. Is there actually another no, one? No, there's not. Oh, that was it? That, that was it. Okay. I really didn't know if you were serious <laughs> yeah. or not. Yeah. Holy shit. So, Deathheim, clear. Deathheim. Where would you put that um, in terms of hard final bosses? I don't know. It's like a medium to hard boss. I wouldn't say it's the hardest. It's not like... I think like as an endurance, it looks insane that they make you fight all those bosses yeah. without giving you a, like any... You like, know what though? Now that he's know. properly equipped and had enough magic and health mm -hmm. and yeah. lives, it wasn't nearly as bad as... It wasn't nearly as bad. The, just having the extra few health and mm -hmm. the, the extra magic really makes a difference. There's the end, folks. We did it. That's an act racer, and it's an awesome game. Try it out. Play it. <laughs> Hopefully less than three months. <laughs> <laughs>